it's Amy. Yeah, you probably hear the heater because it's cold and snowing. Yeah, finally. <laughs> All right, um, thrift haul. I told you there would probably be a lot of them back to back so I could get caught up. This is an item I'm keeping. It was $3.50. Uh, this says sleigh bells ring and it has big jingly bells at the bottom. So, yeah, that's not, I don't really like this. So, $3.50. I didn't think that was too bad. Put it back in the bag so I can go ahead and take it downstairs. Tony got our Halloween and Christmas put into separate areas so now it doesn't look like Jack Skellington and Santa went on a bender and threw up everywhere. <laughs> so we have more room but we've also purged some stuff. Picked up one of the little glass snowmen canisters. I think these are anchor hawking. Is that right? I think that's right. Um, it's 50 cents. So, probably sell this next year. Um, Christmas trivet. I liked it because it looked vintage. But it says peace. That's just a little cork trivet. Um, it's by Harton H-A-R-T-I-N got this vintage looking garland I don't know if it actually is vintage but it's painted to, it's got like holly on it was two dollars and they mark it down to a dollar I don't know if I'll keep this or sell it like I said, I really don't know if it's vintage. So part of me thinks it's not, but I just, I don't know. Oh, yeah, I got my Big Fat Greek Wedding 2. Love these movies. And I didn't have the second one for some reason. Um, Scrabble. It was $2. It actually does sell for around 10 so it's a quick flip. Even though it's an older PC game. Some of those big box PC games can sell really well. Um, Sweet Stuff Bakery. This is another one of those Jan Karen pieces. And I grabbed it because I sold some of the other little Jan Karen pieces that I picked up for, what were they, $5 each? And I sold them for $50 each, so... Um, Jane Karen wrote a book series. It's set here in North Carolina about a priest. And. Well, he's not a. Yeah. He's a priest. Yeah. Um, anyway, I'm not actually sure what this is. I don't know if it's like a trivet or, or what it is. Looks like the bakery front. It's got a little cat sleeping out front. That's 50 cents. I think I said that multiple times. Just in case you didn't know it was 50 cents. How much was that? <laughs> 50 cents! <laughs> These were so pretty. These are Holiday Collection um, WMA Rogers Holiday Wreath Coasters. I'll take them out and show them to you. This is an item that I may keep. I mean, they are just so pretty. Um, tarnish resistant, clean with a soft, damp cloth, no silver polish, Japan. So they are really pretty enamel. There's four of them in here. I think I just answered my own question on if I'm going to keep them because. These two are stuck together. Okay, they finally came apart. But 
thought I saw a chip in one of them. Anyway, like I said, I really may keep these. It is, they're so pretty. It says silver plated. That's what they wrote on the box, but it doesn't say anything on it about being silver plated. So it's Onada Silver Smith. They might be silver plated, but two dollars. I'll probably keep them. Purchased two pins. They were a dollar a piece. I'm just I'm watching it snow out the window. That's why I keep looking up. This one looked really old. I mean, it, okay, well, not really old. But, oh, I know why I bought this one. It's got dried pressed flowers inside. And I have done really good with pressed flower stuff. And then this one is a cat. They were both just a dollar. I like selling pins and brooches. this because it's just super retro and vintage. I mean, it is vintage. I wanted two dollars for it. And I mean, it's like 1950s. Um, it's just like this fruit necklace. It's got these little clear leaves. Very lightweight. Um, it's very kitschy, you know. It's two dollars and just yeah. Okay, this was stupidity on my part. Um I was like, oh wow, this is a hand painted glass ornament. It, you know, cute. But and it was fifty cents, it came in a box. And the box says Christmas house. <laughs> Dollar Tree distributed. <laughs> so, okay. But it was only 50 cents. So. Say, so if you're going to be a reseller, please learn Dollar Tree items. It's not that Dollar Tree items can't sell for more than a dollar because they can, but you never want to pay more than a dollar. <laughs> Oh, I forgot about this. I don't know if I'll keep this or if I'll sell it. But it's a three-piece little set. It's like blue and white. Um, the lid comes off and then you've got like a little strainer dish inside got holes in it and you put your soap at least I'm pretty sure that's what you put in there now I paid out for this it was five dollars um Victoria wear it's got I think those are a lion and a unicorn I haven't decided if I'm going to sell it or not. I probably will sell it. I can't remember what he charged me for this, but I'm going to keep it and just put it in our Christmas stuff. So the joy of a, Chris the joy of a Peanuts Christmas 50 Years of Holiday Comics. And it just gives different decades of the holiday comics that he put out. This was three dollars. It's by Primark. Little jewelry box. It's got like this. I don't think it's real leather. I don't know. Leatherette. <laughs> because I, I don't know if it's real leather. And here's the inside. It's very 1970s. 
I mean, that's what the colors look like to me. And I really strongly believe the 70s are coming back. So I'll be looking for 70s stuff. If you want to resell it. Um, last item is another item for us. It's 50 cents. And it just says days until Christmas. Or no, days until Santa comes to town. It's from Huntington Home. Which I don't know who Huntington Home is. Oh, it's Aldi. So, like I said, only 50 cents. We're going to be getting an Aldi. Well, not here. It's like 40 miles away. But it's kind of like here because we live in this rural south. So 40 miles isn't that big of a deal. Oh, Aldi aim right next to it at Chick-fil-A. So, that'll be fun. So, I'm going to show you one more bag and then I'll cut this one. little pin holder and it has a little ship inside. I thought that was cute. It was $1.99. This was 49 cents. It's just a little wood carved sleigh. I don't know if you like just put it in a vignette or I mean, it doesn't have anything to hang it from the tree so Cat was 99 cents and it may have been 50% off. I just like strawberries. Ribbon around its neck. Got a little pumpkin. It's, it's got some paint chipping, but we'll probably just keep this for our own stuff. Seasons greetings. This was 49 cents. I've done so well with figure figural candles. And she's so cute. Or he. I don't know if it's he or she. Like, is that supposed to be Santa or Mrs. Santa? I have to share this with somebody because maybe somebody will care. Disney Plus is gonna have a Santa Claus series with Tim Allen. So happy. Okay. You know, I don't know we found out about it now. We won't see it for like a year, but or almost a year. If it even comes out this year. That's some vintage beaded toasters from my 49 cents. Anyway, I was excited. This is Zeon Lutheran Church, Roseland, Florida. I got it because it was definitely vintage in the USA. Um, it almost looks like it could be sterling, but it doesn't say anything about being sterling. And the last item, I had purchased a few of these, so when I do finally list them next year, or well, next Christmas, I'll have a few to list. It's the December Diamonds, this little fairy in a wreath that one of my... So, that is this thrift haul. The snowflakes are getting bigger. <laughs> um, I'll probably put something about that in my vlog I'll be back with another thrift haul like probably well you'll see it sometime soon be sure to like comment share subscribe hit that bell so you never miss a video and I'll see you next time bye